I applied to the University of Dayton as a pre-med student, realized that I hate chemistry, just can't do it. And I love physics, and I've loved my classes, especially um, uh, dynamics and mechanics, just your basic core engineering classes. I've loved the experience, and in this lab, I've learned that you can apply those principles to the human body. So I really like the research aspect of biomechanics, as well as the practical, what can we design that will improve function in this way. My name is Erin Sutton, and I'm majoring in mechanical engineering. I'm also the lab director for the University of Dayton's Engineering Wellness and Safety Lab. We are an undergraduate lab with eight researchers who do research specifically in biomechanics, so applying engineering principles to the way the body moves. Falls are a leading cause of injury death in the elderly population, and one of the goals of our lab, the Engineering Wellness and Safety Lab, is to reduce the prevalence of falls in the elderly population. So we're doing studies on the effects on balance of certain things like holding grocery bags or does the way the test is conducted actually affect the results that the clinician gets. So we do studies on that as well as the effects of your age on a person's gait, so how they walk. Last January we submitted the abstract for our pilot grocery bag study to the American Society of Biomechanics. It was chosen uh, for the poster presentation at their 2010 meeting. So in August, Dr. Bigelow and I went to this uh, big biomechanics conference in Rhode Island. We presented uh, our research, found out we were the only undergraduates presenting any kind of research there. And it was especially interesting to see how our research at this lab fit in so well with the other posturography and balance research currently going on. The fact that engineering can have a direct impact on someone's quality of life has been my favorite part of working here because I actually get to meet the participants. So it's the link between engineering and people that I think is so interesting. I can work medicine and um, human factors into mechanical engineering and use mechanical engineering to improve someone's life.